Hi, so I just wanted to do a little gaming review here with the new Sony Xperia XZ comparing against some flagship phones. Uh, we do have the Galaxy S7 uh, and the iPhone 7. Uh, so we want to check out the performance here across all of the devices and we are going to put them on the max. So you can't put it on the max with the iPhone but we assume it is on the max. We're also going to turn the volume up on uh, all of them so you can hear the speaker performance. So you can see that one's on the max as well. And we'll just turn it up. So straight away, you know, I'm hearing quite a nice loudness from the iPhone. Uh, but we're going to start them up now. So let's go. So iPhone is the winner when it comes to the startup. Sony's second and Samsung's last. I think Samsung's slipping if you ask me. Uh, so we're going to have a look on the iPhone here see uh, how the gaming is so this comes with the Apple A10 A10 processor man what is this bottom shelf liquor we drink Diablo. go see mama suck my dick step up little G I ain't that dumb G I really like the speakers here the speakers are amazing on the iPhone 7. Did you like your face? I don't like Raise the resolution. The resolution is pretty bad. Well, it seems very nice and, nice and smooth overall. And there isn't much heat coming from the back. Which is nice. So you can see the frame rate is very good and there's no graphical glitches. So very nice gaming here. Uh, so we're just going to pause the iPhone and then we're going to have a look at the Samsung. So this is coming with the Exynos 8890 and you do have a speaker on the side of thing, no front facing. And you can see this, the biggest problem with Samsung is that they can't optimize a device hey, very funny, amigo. when it comes to this game. Well, one thing I do like about Samsung is they put the best displays on their phones, so this just blows away the iPhone 2K AMOLED superior viewing angles just a shame they don't really uh, optimize the graphics but you can see the actual frame rate is quite good here I'm pretty convinced that Rockstar what they do every year is that they, they make the game that little bit more graphically demanding. To me, it seems that way. Because I remember old devices, old, de old devices like the LGD2 played this very fl fluently without any problems. But this is having some problems. Either that or we're going backwards in terms of technology. But you know, it does the job here. Very vibrant screen on the Samsung, which I think you will enjoy. Finally, we do have the Sony Xperia XZ. This is the newest flagship from Sony Boy. And we're going to have a look here at the performance. So the speakers are on the max, and you do get front facing stereo speakers. Suck my motherfucking dick, man. What you want to do 
know that, bro. I ain't no Gold gang bang. Gold are slipping, man. You know you fucking with. So, very nice uh, sound quality here on the Max. Probably not quite as loud as the iPhone. I think the iPhone is louder. Uh, one thing I do notice is the display it looks uh, a lot more vibrant than the iPhones because it is full HD, obviously. But the bezels are a little bit big. I'd like to see improvement there because you could land an airplane on them currently. But other than that, they are very, you know, serviceable. Thanks, homie. I think I think the XZ is a good all rounder. Really, you can see there's no graphical chipping. Frame rate very smooth. Snapdragon 820. You do only get three gigs of RAM though. So if you do like your multitasking during gaming, you might suffer in future. But overall, I think I'm going to crown the Sony the winner here. I think Sony is the winner here because it has the stability. It has a very nice big screen, full HD. It runs cool, front-facing stereo speakers. And I think Sony is the winner. I'll give it to Samsung. I'll give it to Samsung when it comes to the display. And I'll give it to Apple when it comes to speaker loudness. But I think the XC is a good all-rounder here. So let's, let's say XC and then uh, XZ. Uh, so yeah, you know, uh, just a quick little gaming comparison review here of the... Uh, the latest uh, high-end phones here that we do have. Uh, I'll probably play some more games as well if anybody you know wants to see that. Uh, there are a lot of games available for uh, these devices nowadays. I don't really know, you know, every single game, but I do know a few of them. Uh, so uh, yeah, I hope you uh, enjoyed the video, found it helpful, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.